you have a camper or an RV that although it's in storage, it's still getting oxidized, what do you do? Stay tuned. Hey, welcome to the shop. When it comes to RVs and being stored, one of the things that's very common is that you find one end cap or the other or both exposed to the direct sunlight over time. What happens is you'll have the sides which will remain looking new, but then you'll have the end caps that are starting to fade, decals start to crack, things of that nature. So what do you do? So on this particular one, what we're gonna do is uh, restore it. So we're gonna do that by way of taking off the stickers. All the decals that are there, we're gonna go in steam clean and remove them. After we do that, then we're gonna come in and we're going to remove the oxidation. So we're gonna polish out all the oxidation that's there. We wanna restore it back to the color, as close as we can get to the original color. Now, the thing that you have to keep in mind is that's the restoration process. Even though you're moving decals, you're polishing it out and it looks new, you can't just stop there. You have to go back and protect it. If you think about it, when these things are first painted, they, the protection is in the original paint job. So in other words, when they put the paint on there, it's to add color, but it's also to protect. Once it starts to break down and fade, and even though you're restoring it and bringing the color back, a lot of the initial protection is gone or has faded tremendously. So what we wanna do now that we go back and restore it, we have to go back and say, okay, how do we maximize or how do we protect it? So we're gonna do that with a G-Technic product that is actually a marine product. It's gonna function similarly on a boat as well as on an RV. So what we're gonna do on this, after we get this perfected, the color is back close to new as we can get it, then we're gonna come back and we're going to put a two-step process on it. So it would be G-Technic marine base and marine top coat. So we'll go through and then we'll coat it. That will put that protective coating back on there, make it UV protectant and things of that nature. So that'll be the steps that we're gonna follow in this. So stay tuned, we'll post some pictures of the transformation.